Hello everyone. I hope you're having a better day today than you did yesterday. I am Lena Cola. Welcome to my channel. If you're coming here for the first time, thank you so much for coming. If you're always here, it is good to see you again. I hope you will continue to stay with my channel as I have great things in store for you. My channel is to inspire you through my songs, through sharing my experiences, through motivating you, and through educating you on issues that affect humanity. Today I will be talking about an issue that affects so many of us as human beings, and that is jealousy. So I want to talk about how to stop being jealous. Yes, we, I want to talk about the green-eyed monster, the misuse of your imagination. In every situation where you feel insecure, it's coming from a place of lack of confidence, lack of self-doubt, fear, and insecurity. If you know your worth, you'll never ever be jealous of anyone. I know there are different definitions of beauty, um, but I've met people who I considered um, very beautiful. They have everything going for them, and yet still they think they are ugly. It is because you are comparing yourself to other people, and um, comparing yourself to other people, it's, it's, not, it's not a good thing. One, because some people, in, in, in terms of what they have acquired, what they have achieved, have worked very, very hard to get where they are. So it is the insecurity within you, um, knowing that you've always wanted those things, that have created that feeling inside of you. Jealousy is very psychological. It is a message from your brain telling you that something isn't quite right about the way you're feeling and you must change. How do you overcome jealousy? This is very simple. Um, tell yourself that you're the greatest and that you're not in competition with anyone else. You are unique, you're special, your fingerprints are different, your hair is different, your face is different, and everything about you is different. So it means that you're the greatest version of you, right? So you're not quite like anyone else, and you should not be in competition with anyone else. So I'm doing this video and there is a fan close to me, honestly, because it's extremely very hot and I was sweating profusely. So I had to use a fan and um, never mind the my <laughs> my movement um, it is it is very very warm today but I, I, I really love this type of weather let's move forward another way is to write 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 document your thoughts when the feelings arise just tell yourself that I need to nip it in the bud nip it right in the bud and you move forward um, when you acknowledge, when you have acknowledged that this is what is causing me to feel jealous, then you will learn how to move past that phase. When you do the introspection, the self-talk and the documentation, what you're actually doing is removing the weaknesses. At the end of the day, there is really nothing wrong with jealousy, but it's how you respond to it. Some people respond negatively, some respond in a positive way. If you agree with me, um, let's just discuss in the comment section. Let us, let us look at the positive way um, just a little bit. Uh, jealousy can motivate you to do better in life. Okay, so you see that woman with the big house and the big car or that man with the money and you are in a small position at the moment and um, it can motivate you to excel to push yourself more as well as the green-eyed monster can just flare up and have the wicked intention that the only desire that you have within you is to hate someone else or hurt somebody else um, based on what they have. 
jealousy is such a, a sneaky emotion and it, it means that you are feeling threatened the fundamental thing is that one has a false sense of self and um, it just typically means that they are very unhappy on the inside and uh, as I've said before once you start to label jealousy you acknowledge it when it appears um, maybe by writing it down or speaking it to yourself um, then you are in the position to um, to nip it in the bud right away what we really need in life is contentment fulfillment love peace acquiring things don't really get you um, value within I've mentioned this in one of my previous videos eight ways to stay confident I will put it in the description box below and you can check it out I hope you will like it because it does go into some important steps on how you can acquire confidence there is one thing that I have um, come to learn in life and it's that no human relationship can make you really happy. They, what they can give you is fun, excitement, money, a job, but they can't give you value within. They can't give you joy within because if you depend on others, um, so it, it, it is kind of weird because if that person is unhappy then you become unhappy if that person is 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 happy you know then you are happy too no you have to find your personal joy within the life within um, you have to uh, find uh, find out how you can be the strongest version of yourself what does the Bible say about jealousy James chapter 3 and verse 16 says for where jealousy and selfish ambition exist, there will be disorder and every vile practice. If you go to Exodus 20, it will tell you that you shouldn't covet your neighbor's wife, your neighbor's house, your neighbor's cattle, ox, ass, the neighbor's servants, or whatever the neighbor has. You should not envy your neighbor then we go to Romans 12 verse 2 and it says that we should not be conformed to this world but be transformed by the renewing of your mind the renewing of your mind takes great positive thoughts clean thoughts towards yourself and others and it is something that you have to really constantly work on jealousy is misused imagination you know you really um, you can't get better than that it is misused imagination and um, one word of advice to anyone that may be listening to this and you have uh, been experiencing those feelings is that um, you should stop for a moment explore the past and, and try to discover where the jealousy patterns may have been generated you can be great you can let it go you can get rid of it so fast um, and uh, one thing I noticed and on social media really you can obviously see the patterns in people uh, um, who are really jealous of others um, you know you can see it the things that they say um, the things that they write um, you know you, you can identify that this is hate and jealousy um, it's coming from a not so good place within you know um, it is now easy to spot really because social media um, have a way of showing everything up um, but we can learn that what is what is good what is right what is the acceptable will of God you have to think great and positive thoughts as I mentioned before towards those around you there is absolutely nothing wrong with being happy for someone 
There's nothing wrong to wish somebody happy birthday. Not because you have never had a party. It is okay to be happy when somebody else gets married, when somebody else um, buys a house. It is okay to um, be happy for someone who just, um, who have had a baby. I remember when I got pregnant and I had my son, I mentioned it to a particular um family member it was the weirdest thing i mentioned it to a particular family member who has not spoken to me since that day did not respond to the message and has uh, did not respond to the message and has not spoken to me until this day and we were great friends um so not because you can't have children um so if someone says okay i i'm pregnant just be happy be joyful uh, for that person. Your time will come. Um, manifest the things. And another word for manifestation is really praying. Pray for what you want. And you will really have it coming to you in no time at all. I don't worry about things. I don't put my trust in things. I don't put value in anything of the sort. Um, that is materialistic because I know that uh, it can go any minute. So my, I put value in people. I put value in doing this channel because I know that there are people who will be coming who needs help. I'm not doing this for financial gain. I am doing this because I've always wanted to help others. And so I am here before you today, right, to share the knowledge that I know and from from what I have experienced and from what I've researched um, I, I want to share it with you you know so that you can learn vicariously you may not have to go through what I went through or what others went through but you can learn from this experience so um, this is the end of the video and if you really love it um, you know give it a thumbs up comment below and let's uh, discuss a little about jealousy and you may be able to tell us of a time when you have experienced jealousy or when someone was jealous towards you. Um, let us make the change. Be the change you want to see in the world and take very good care of yourself. Remember that you are amazing. And once again, I'm Lee Nicola and I'll see you in my next video. <laughs>